Morning everyone! Day 3 in Amsterdam and I had a really really good sleep. Um, I went to bed early last night and I feel a lot, of be a lot better. My top lip is a tiny bit swollen but my eyes are fine so it's all good. Um, today's a new day and sorry for the tip in the background. Um, Winky's there behind the door changing because um, her stockings she um, this morning she was like oh my god all my stockings have holes in them so she's borrowing mine so I don't know why I decided to tell that story but just in case she pops out and you're like what what's happening um, today we are off to the village of I can't pronounce it I'm gonna let Winky pronounce it how do you pronounce it Winky? It's nice, <laughs> nice. Nice yelling. Um, if you can't hear her, I'll write the proper spelling and everything here and down in the description box below. But basically, it's a village known for their windmills. And if you ever hear of Amsterdam, if you've ever been to Amsterdam, you know they're very well known for their windmills. It's like a stereotypical thing. But yeah, it'd be nice to visit. We're going on a tour thing. So um, same old, same old. Now we're off to breakfast. I should probably wake Emily up because she's always the latest. We have made it to the windmills and we've actually deviated from our tour group because as usual I wanted to take some vlog photos but now we're exploring on our own lonesome. It's very very sunny and warm. Today. Huh? I don't know. Um, nearly got ran over by the ambulance but it's all good now. Look how lovely this place is though. was with the tour before when we were at the last place that I can't pronounce. It is really warm actually. It's like I feel like degrees. melting. Yep. Um, now we're off to the museum and then we're gonna go by boat. Charles dance. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Keep your wrinkles away. 
So as you can see, I drink it every day and I'm 53 years old. <laughs> Looks good, right? Thanks. <laughs> After that, we push the curds into these molds together with the stand which tells us what kind of cheese it is. Then we put the molds under the pressing machine for two hours and after two hours we have a cheese like this. Then we put the cheeses in the brain bath for 24 hours. This is 80% water and 20% salt. It gives the cheese a better salty taste and a natural rice. Then we put the cheeses on the wooden shelves where they can rest and dry. And we also classify the cheeses to protect them against mildew and dry accounts. After four weeks, we finally can eat the cheese and we talk about young cheese. again for lunch because the tour guide told us to go to a particular fish and chip shop and he said it was the best but Winky our tour guide and local has whispered in our ear that this is this actually this place is the best fish and chip place so it looks really good yeah we've broken apart from them and then she says these crab claws are the best and I've got crab claws um, fish uh, codfish and calamari. calamari and the chips and this is the delicacy. What is this called? Hari. 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 Okay. Hari. We're gonna try it. Okay. I don't know what Let's it is. Let's go. It's I think we should try the Hari one first. Yeah. Is it like, like just this? like just one like this? Yeah. You eat that with the um, uh, stuff the pickle as well. So. Yep. With the pickle. Oh, with the pickle. And then we're thingy. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Go. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> Fishy. But this one is really healthy though. <laughs> Emily loves it. It's new like favorite the food. I like the pickle. Less extremes uh, after. Uh, but yes, she did a great movie. Tomorrow, the machines are 80 years old, uh, 80 ans, the machines. and tomorrow is their birthday. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yes, yes, so tomorrow we're gonna sing for them. Oh. If you come here tomorrow, it's a nice day, right? Take an ice cream. Too. Yeah. You know what we sing? <laughs> well, let's try. We sing Happy Birthday. Yeah, that's wrong. That's wrong. Yeah. To the machine, of course. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, but that's tomorrow. Uh, let's uh, start the inside. Same system. Mem system. <laughs> We're leaving our 
Amsterdam in this hotel today. Bye, piano. My dream piano. Bye. See you. Bye, beautiful red mirror. Hello, everyone. Um, yeah, so today we're off to Den Haag and we're going to catch the train there. And I don't know if I'm going to vlog a lot today because I think most of it will just be spent on the train. Um, but I'll check in with you guys once we get to Den Haag. with you on the boat but if you saw scenes of us on the boat it was because we had a free cruise to use up because when we went on the tour yesterday they gave us a free cruise and so we went on that but I didn't want to whip out my camera um, on the boat because I have this phobia of dropping my phone my camera um, in the water which then from when I was a child and Emily dropped my phone in the water so yeah she's to blame for that trauma so I didn't uh, like how many years ago now well, that means like, it's deep root of trauma, okay? Decades. <laughs> it's deep root of trauma. Because of the phone. Your crotch bottle. Yes. Nice. Nice. <laughs> I'm sweating my face. It's so glam traveling stuff. Yeah. Travel in Spartan styles. Still, we needed like best <laughs> <laughs> Woo, we've made it to our hotel in Denha. Everyone is knackered because we chose to travel on the hottest day of the year, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh it's like 29? Yes, it's 29 degrees today. There's a full length mirror here, which yeah. we didn't have in the other hotel. Even though we did have a huge mirror, it was like, it was too, but it was so high. I had to keep jumping up just to see my crotch. <laughs> I was like, um, yes, yeah, valid. I don't know. It's just easier to see in here. Um, uh, yeah, I guess I might end the vlog for today because we're not going to do anything else majorly exciting except take a shower because oh, we yeah. are sweating and gross as you can see by my face. Got sunglasses, marks everywhere. You can smell me from here. Yeah. yeah. That might just be my crush. I <laughs> yeah, Emily's suffering from sweaty crush syndrome. Uh